Okay, hey, it's Empress Lux Hashem. I'm here to do a reading on T.D. Jakes. We have probably all have seen how he had a medical situation that happened the other day. Um, the channel message I got from for him is leaves. Like, uh, it may be something significant about the seasons where we see more leaves, which we're in that now. And winter, going well, this kind of would be winter or fall, winter. Or him having to leave. Um, I also feel like there's going to be something about collapsing, falling outside of what happened. Like something else. Possibly with his career, you know. Um, also, medicine is being highlighted. It actually came out in the Angel Ancestor message again. So, there's something about medicine. I don't know if he was given something. He will be given something to take. Um, Spirit is highlighting secrets in business. Something may come out. He's one of the ones. It was him and Joel Osteen that at the beginning of the year, I felt like something would come out about him. There's also something about a portal or a door being highlighted with him. That is in reverse. Um, also, finances is being highlighted. Funds being low. Watch the boss. Um, him receiving more time. Black magic is being highlighted. Something about... Someone's having dreams about him or he's in someone's dreams or vice versa. It's in reverse. And also, vacation is in reverse. Secrets around children or his own children having secrets, you know. Um, tossing and turning. So, there, it's like somebody's having sleep issues. Lesbian is being highlighted. Living out loud. Wifey in reverse. Hell in reverse. Uh, monitoring spirits. Overseas bank accounts. The truth will hurt him. It may have may already be hurting him. Trapped in a closet. And in reverse is dying and Pandora's box. I do believe that he opened Pandora's box and you know this and there's no telling what happens when you open Pandora's box. Cancer or cancer seasons being highlighted, an interracial couple. Dairy air is being highlighted. Um like bum, but saving money. Something not growing, Aquarius or Aquarius season is in reverse. Also, Capricorn season is being highlighted in reverse as well. Yo, pregnancy. It's the pregnancy energy came out twice. That's in the shadows is in reverse. Um, spiritual junkie, altar work, childhood trauma. Listen, I this is the second I got pregnancy energy now for him. Uh, yeah, angel ancestor message. Um, that's that medicine. Like he's not being open to healing information, or he wasn't. So like I said, medicine's being highlighted. Also, him need to take time to reflect because he wasn't, and him also not truly listening to the voice of his soul. So now he's gonna need that time to reflect. And like I said, um, there was this fertility energy that came out from him. Earth mother, when this shows up, this talks about feeling love and confident. And this also talks about healing a mother wound or possible pregnancy, fertility. And this part with a guardian angel, you're not alone. He may have a mother figure that's a guardian angel for him. Interestingly enough, when we get into the tarot, the first card that came out is Eight of Cups. That's somebody walking away. That is somebody leaving. This is disappointment, disillusionment, leave, action, change, abandonment, detachment, going on a soul-searching journey, seek a higher meaning and wisdom. This also highlights stability, prosperity, justice, power, strength, judgment, fortuity, success, and harvest. But the you can't see it, but the image is a male figure walking away, walking away and leaving some things behind. Then he has nine of pentacles. The number eight is being highlighted. So we may hear something significant in between eight days, eight months, eight weeks, eight hours. So far, it's being highlighted. Next is the nine of pentacles with the number nine. This talks about success, prosperity, overall, having self-discipline, independent, good news, inner peace. Interestingly enough, this card does talk about being single, being alone. So there may be some relationship issues. Yeah, Knight of Cups. This is like um, having great people skills. He is very great. I used to love T.D. Jakes. I'm more so a Sarah Jakes fan now. And this talks about him focusing on emotion and being compassionate, compassionate or people's energy towards him. And this also talks about him connecting with his emotion and intuition, his feelings, spirit, desire, their inner self, and relationships. I feel like something's going to be offered to him. Or he's going to offer something. Something's going to be offered after this bad news. Because that's how it's coming out. Something being offered after bad news. With the eight of ones 
reverse. So eight is being highlighted again. It's like slow action, something being out of control, too hastily, an altercation, something remaining stagnant, procrastination, and bad news. So something being offered that leads to bad news or something being offered after this bad news with him. Get in touch with his emotions. That, that, that's what I have. I didn't want to dive too deep into this. But um, I sent him the best wishes. Have you on a feminine energy in his reading? I don't know. He could be a masculine that has a lot of feminine energy. But like I said, wifey came out in reverse. So there's something there. And then we have pregnancy energy. Came out. Could be. It doesn't have to be birthing a baby. But it's like birthing something new. Have you been swallowed up? <laughs> so, um, but send him my best of wishes to him.